you know and I know that the standard in the world has been lowered so low that service is not what it used to be. Amen. We live in an entitled society. The standard has been lowered so low that we have accepted mediocrity. We've accepted that. But I believe that as people of God, we've got to raise the standard. We can't look to the world to, to set a, a standard for us. We can't look to our culture to set a standard for us. We can't look to our friends to set a standard to, for us. We've got to look to God and his word to set a standard for us. Amen. Telling the truth all the time. Amen. Not just telling the truth when it benefits your side. That's integrity. Here are some ways that we compromise our integrity. We compromise our integrity when we lie on our resume. You said you're a surgeon, and now you're in the operating room and don't even know what the utensils are. <laughs> Lying about your income to qualify for a loan. They asked you how much you make a year integrity these are things that compromise our integrity lying on a date about why a past relationship didn't work you tell everybody you broke up with them integrity issue lying about why you are late integrity issue and we wonder why our prayers aren't getting any higher than the ceiling we wonder why we're not seeing things that we know God wants to give us we have to make sure that we are living by a standard church and God's standard hasn't changed people have dummied his standard down but I'm here to tell you that God has a standard for us and this is the thing that should distinguish us between the believer and the non-believers by the standard that we live people should see a difference in the way that you react to problems people should see a difference in the way whether or not you laughing at, at, at dirty jokes all of those things are a standard that you and I need to be living by amen. can you say amen to that this might not be something you shout over, but it's something I want you to think about. When you, your feet hit the pavement tomorrow morning, you go in on that job, or you log into your computer, I want you to hear me saying to you, I am a person of integrity. Because God is watching us to make sure that we are honorable people and a good witness to the people we come in contact with. Can you say amen to that? Seeds of greatness, seeds of greatness in you.